Hi, I'm Carrie. Welcome to my channel. Today I'm here to talk about the MetaBoost Connection. Um, it's a program developed by Meredith with this felt training program. I'm just nearly into it, so I just want to discuss what I've noticed so far with this program and why I decided to join it. So I am 46. I saw an ad through Facebook or Instagram, one of the two, and it was advertising this eating and workout program and it was uh, targeted to women over 40 um, and it talked about the way that the meals are prepped that it could help you with balancing your hormones which is definitely an issue that I suffer from. Um, I have very high estrogen and testosterone and I'm trying to regulate that especially to help me sleep better at night. So uh, the other day, this past week actually, I joined the program. Um, you can do the initial program or you can do, I'm going to call it the advanced program where you can pay a little bit extra and then you can, can have access to their Facebook group and support group. And then you can also have access to ongoing meal plans uh, for as long as it continues. Um, and definitely, I guess. So uh, for me, um, I'm not a meal planner. Uh, I have, I belong to this macro group on Facebook and I tried the macro thing and it's too much math for me. I don't enjoy it. I don't like calculating my food. I don't like searching how many macros are in any of it. So this program is great. It uh, lays out for you what you're supposed to have every day. Um, it starts with a couple of sections. So the first section of the program, you're going to do a one day flush. You start with a tonic in the morning. Uh, it's warm water, lemon, honey, a pinch of cayenne and some ginger. And that's to get your metabolism going. Um, it incorporates smoothies and clean eating, which I really appreciate. The one thing I find if you're on an eating program or this um, a macros or anything you can still eat really unhealthy but as long as the points or the numbers fit into your day you can eat it but the whole point of this is I just wanted to eat better I can live off of fried egg sandwiches <laughs> um, which definitely isn't great it's not enough fiber in my diet and I need more fiber in my diet. And what I've noticed with this eating plan so far is there's lots of greens, broccoli, kale, arugula, leafy greens, lots of vegetables, um, lean meats like chicken and salmon. Now I am not a salmon fan, so I will be opting out for chicken. Um, there's smoothies every day and I've enjoyed for the most part, all of them except one um, I wasn't a big fan of but most of them I do really enjoy. Yeah, and just the combinations of foods. Um, if you follow Meredith on Instagram or Facebook, uh, she talks about food combinations and how they work together to, to work better and burn better in your system. And apparently the people who have been following this are feeling a lot better and that is a bonus. I would love to have more energy. I have two kids, they're nine and six, and I am an older mom, and I would love to have more energy to keep up with them. For the most part, it's it's fairly easy shopping. Um, I have a small grocery store in town where I live, so I could find most of the things that I needed. Um, the one day I needed coconut water, and they actually carried that, which I was surprised. Um, I did go to Costco the other day and I do a, I did a big haul for what I needed for big things like portobello mushrooms and peppers and that sort of thing just to buy them in bulk so I had them on hand. I did order two items off Amazon because I wasn't sure where I could go to find them. Probably a health food store for sure but it was just easier to order on Amazon and then it was one day shipping. So the first item that I ordered was goji berries which I knew nothing about. I just have them in my mason jar for my pantry um, but I did buy them on Amazon so I can put a link below uh, the kind that I ordered and they taste pretty good actually they kind of remind me of the texture of a raisin but they have lots and lots of health benefits I had no idea how good these were for you until I researched them a little bit and the other product that I ordered off Amazon was spirulina now I haven't tried this before but I know it's amazing for you um, the reviews for the Organica on Amazon seemed pretty decent and I use Organica collagen so I just figured 
I would trust that brand and order it. So I haven't even opened it yet because it hasn't, um, the recipes are coming that require this. So I'll put a link for this below as well. Okay, also in this program. So they include um, your meal plan and they also include a workout plan. I am not going to dive into the workout plan right now because I have a workout plan that I already follow. I follow Heather Robertson. I'll put a link below so that you can click on her webpage and she has different kinds of workouts. She has a monthly calendar that I love following. So for me, I'm just going to focus on the meal one thing at a time, I think, so I don't get overloaded. I feel like if I were to do the meals and the workouts, it might be too much for me to organize and focus. So I'm just solely going to use the Meta Boost connection for the meal planning. And it has gone really well so far. Um, I did the flush. I'm on day three um, of the regular eating plan. The first three days are called belly blaster and then you have your next seven days. As I mentioned, it's clean eating, uh, which I really enjoy. Pretty simple meal prep, a couple of spices, nothing out of the ordinary. Tonight's dinner is supposed to be salmon um, with carrots and some other veggies grilled and I'm gonna opt for chicken again because I don't really love salmon but they have a list of swaps that you can do if um, you don't prefer one food over the other. I know coming up, I heard that there's supposed to be sardines coming up in the menu plan, which that is definitely not gonna happen. So I'll be doing another swap for sardines. So uh, generally uh, I wanted again to do this program because I am over 40, I'm approaching 50 in a couple, well, three, three and a half years. Um, I wanted to get my nutrition under control. I know that as women age and we enter menopause, weight gain is a really big issue. Um, I work out seven days a week. So five days a week, I do Heather Robertson and every day I walk my dog twice a day for 35 to 40 minutes. So I am active, but I get frustrated because I do find that I get stuck. I get stuck. My stuck number is like 143 on the scale or 145 or whatever it is. Um, and with my workouts, I feel like I should be seeing more results and I know it's my nutrition. I know that I'm stronger. I can see more definition from when I started the Heather Robertson workouts, but I just want more gains and I know it's my food because I don't eat a balanced diet. And this I'm hoping will offer me that opportunity to have a balanced meal plan, a clean balanced meal plan. So when I started the flush, I weighed myself in the morning. I was 143.4 um, on day one of the belly blaster, which was the following day, I was 142. And then this morning I'm on day three of the belly blaster and I weighed myself and I was 140. And I know that the number on the scale is not the dictator. I totally, I totally know that. Um, I didn't do any measurements when I started. I'm actually going to use a pair of pants that I'm going to show you in a minute as my gauge of how the program's working for me. I bought these pants a long time ago and they kind of fit a little bit tight, but <laughs> over time they've just kind of gotten a little bit tighter. So I know, I know I need to rein in on my nutrition and eat better. So um, this is going to be my gauge at day 10. I'm going to come back on and I'm going to give the rundown of how the 10 days went. As I said, I'm on day three of belly blaster. So I have seven more days to go and we'll see what happens. Um, I can repeat this the 10 days again if I wish or because I'm part of the advanced program, um, I can just download other meal plans that they already have made. I love the fact that they've done the thinking and I just have to do the doing. I don't have to basically lesson plan my meals because that is way overwhelming for me. Everything is laid out. It's pretty accessible. Um, I have found what I needed and if I don't have it at home, I just do a swap according to what their sheet says. Okay, so here are the pants. As you can tell, they're a wee bit tight. <laughs> I had to really stretch the button <laughs> to get them done up. Um, so yeah, I'm going to see how these fit in 10 days and just gauge it by that. And then um, we'll see how things go. 
Uh, I'm very hopeful, I'm optimistic. I've really enjoyed the eating plan. I've enjoyed the prep. Like I said, it's easy, just a couple of spices here and there. A couple of ingredients, as I mentioned, that I ordered off Amazon just because I didn't have them on hand. But overall, I'm feeling good about it. I, again, I like the easiness of it. Um, and from what I can tell on the Facebook group, there are people that are seeing amazing results, which is fantastic for them. For me, I just, I need to get more fiber, I need to balance my eating, and I need to eat a lot more clean um, instead of the grab and, gro grab and go, which is what I'm really used to. So I'll check in at the end of the 10 days and I will let you know how things are going. Thanks for watching.